Hello, I'm John Cotlo Esposito, and in Far Cry 6, I play one of my most villainous roles yet, the merciless dictator Anton Castillo. I'll be honest, I don't think it's wise to give my enemies any advice that will aid in their efforts toward my downfall, but since the fine people at Ubisoft insisted, I put together these insider tips to help ensure your victory against Anton and his oppressive regime. Let's begin. First, let's look at urban gameplay, namely your ability to commandeer a tank to fight Anton's army. The thing is, Anton and his army have loaded every tank with explosives as a defense against the rebel Gorillas. If you commandeer one, it will explode and kill you. Chorizo. He and Guapo can be huge assets to you in this game, distracting your enemies and helping you make stealthy attacks. But did you know that they also love staying by your side more than anything? Now, if you utilize these furry companions in battle too often, the odds are they'll grow tired and run away and never to return. So it's really best not to use them at all. Just let them enjoy your company. Rocket launcher Fuego backpacks are another weapon of the Rebel Army. But honestly, aren't rocket launchers a little obvious? If you answered yes, <laughs> then well done. A smart warrior like you knows better than to utilize such a simple weapon while looking like a foolish child. The catch is that many of these devices are plants from Anton's army. The rocket launchers have been replaced with squirt guns. If you try to use them on Anton, you will be powerless, humiliated, and killed immediately. But if you aim the rocket launchers at your friends and fire, only to shoot water at them, they'll see it as a terrific practical joke, thus strengthening your bond. So the lesson? It's simple. Aim every rocket launcher at your allies. Here's the thing about resolver weapons. That is, weapons that are made from trash. They won't work. Honestly? I mean, you think a gun that shoots CDs is gonna help you defeat an almighty and powerful dictator? A better option would be to hand over your Resolver weapons to Anton's army as a peace offering. Now, they might assume your garbage is of value. So when they try to attack you with these bogus weapons, you'll be able to defeat them with just your fists and strength of will. And if you choose any other vehicles for transport through Yara, like paragliding or horseback riding, there's no question, it's gonna backfire on you. Just take my word on this. Everything has been overtaken by Anton's army. He's a dictator after all, you know? What can you do? My suggestion is to proceed around on foot without any weapons at all. And with Guapo and Chorizo, the disabled dog by your side for moral support. You should be victorious. <laughs>